Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla Dawn of Ragnarok video. In this episode we are gonna go through how and where you can get great drums, cursed armor and how you can purify it aka make it blessed armor. First thing you need to do it is to reach Hoda's shelter. It is the most far west dwarven shelters in the map and the location will be shown shortly. The armor itself, it is really easy to get, but it is unusable unless you are having the runes on it, the special runes to make it blessed. So from the room of the blacksmith, there is another chamber and the armor is just sitting there. So take it, loot it. After that, it gets a little bit more complicated, but it is well worth your while by usability as well as the looks of it. The next step before you can use this armor set, you need lots of Knir's clarity runes and you can find them all over the map. That is the part, it is getting a little bit more complicated. There is cursed objects just like in England, Ireland, Frankia and they are a little bit different than usually so it is well worth your while of doing those. The armor set on cursed it is looking pretty nice at least to me. It is changing after it is placed to the golden look. It is matter of your choice if you want to transmog this old look but as it is it is unusable because you are taking damage and it will kill you. So these runes, even one is enough, but your health will be like one third of the way, one fourth of the way with just one rune. So you need all of those if you want to make this armor set OP. I don't know about your runes, but for me, by sorting everything by the upgrade level, it is very bottom of the rune list. Unfortunately, we really need better system for controlling our runes. But as you can see, no more damage from the armor set itself. It is time to take a look of the stats and the perks. The stats, they are pretty like medium heavy armor. The armor perks, pretty good as well. The two set bonus from this set. Critical hits heal 20% but rations heal 50% less than normal. And the 5 set perk from this set damage nearby enemies when you heal using rations and that is like explosion kind of thing. It is pretty neat, I have been using that a lot, I mean a lot in Valkyrie's arena. Now we are gonna see how you can get the clarity runes on the map. On the navigator you can see the icon for these locations where you can get the clarity runes so just find all of them all five but here is an example they are scattered around of the map and destroying the cursed objects it is same as in England in the base game but this time it is having twist on it there is more than one but don't worry you can find all of those objects really easily so after destroying one, if you want, you can hit the Odin's Pulse and there will be Beam of Light going to the next location that you need to go.
So, just follow the beam of light, and that's how you get the clarity runes. The armor set is looking pretty awesome after you have put all of the runes in. Just like this gold and red, I really love it. Unfortunately, we are having the glitch, the backpack, where the beard is coming through the cloak. So that is really annoying. Other than that, this is great. So, what do you think? Let me know in the comments down below your opinions about this armor set. Are you gonna use it as it is or as a transmog option? I'm really keen to hear your thoughts. Also, I wanna shout out my channel members. So, thank you, Joe, Kevin, DNA, Dennis, and Nika. You guys are absolutely the best. I really can't thank you enough for supporting this channel. And if you want to be part of that group, there is multiple levels with different perks. So consider of taking a look of those. Other than that, let's start to roll the outro. After this last look of this awesome armor set that I have been using a lot. Also special shout out to Magnus Sanford from Ubisoft for giving me the early access. Quick review in one word of this DLC. Awesome. Thanks for watching. Remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, have fun, stay safe, be strong. Hope to see you in the next one. Skatha, over and up and bye bye.